I'm standing on the USS Torsk here in Baltimore Harbor. Throughout the history of this submarine, it only lost one crew member, Seaman Joseph Snow. The events leading to his loss are very instructive. Chaos had broken out on the ship and Seaman Snow was on deck. But because of the chaos, it was not known that he was still on top when the submarine began to go under. And as a result, his life was lost. He was on the top of it, but he wasn't inside of it. And as a result, it cost him his life. The message of this story is simply this. You can be in the vicinity of God and not be where you need to be to experience his deliverance. You can be in church. You can be wearing the right uniform. You can be in the vicinity of other people who are safe. But if you are not in Christ yourself, covered by the blood of Christ, like the other seamen were covered when the submarine went down, then you're left on your own. And the only thing left for you is disaster. Jesus Christ died so you could be covered by his blood. The Bible calls that being in Christ. When you believe on Christ to be your personal Savior, when you trust him alone as your substitute for your sin and look to him alone for the gift of eternal life, he places you in what the Bible calls the ark of safety, where you are covered in time and for eternity. So don't look to your religion, your good works, your human efforts, your religious associations and affiliations to deliver you. You'll be left isolated and alone. Come into the one place that guarantees you eternal safety. That place is the blood of Jesus Christ.